guys welcome to this video as you probably saw from the thumbnail this is an empty <laughs> empty sorbet can so that kind of gives you a gist of how much i liked or disliked this this sorbet um but yeah i'm since i started a new diet that's like lower sugar um i didn't want to rebuy this just for uh, the picture <laughs> so i saved the canister though when i was like done eating it from like a couple from like a week or so ago so this is it's a talenti sorbet brand which is pretty popular it's been in the grocery store for many many years um they have a lot of different flavors um pistachio is another one of my um favorites it's so good but this one i haven't tried up until like maybe like three four weeks ago um i was looking i was coming there to get a harris teeter brand of um strawberry sorbet or strawberry like sherbet basically and they were all sold out so it's kind of forced in a way to like choose something else or not get anything at all so definitely and this was on sale at the time so i kind of looked over the flavors and i was happy to find something that was like dairy free and gluten free because most of the sorbets from that brand does have some like level of sugar i'm sorry not sure have some level of dairy and yeah mainly just dairy that's my the one thing that i really want to avoid and mostly all of them have it but um they have a few dairy free options i want to say there's like maybe one or two more that i noticed that are glute or that are dairy free um so yeah i discovered this one i like that it was a berry flavor it's close enough to strawberry which is what i was going there for in the first place with the other brand and so yeah this is called talenti dairy free sorbetto and it is the flavor is roman raspberry and now it's hard to see but yeah roman raspberry and it is one pint of sorbet sorbetto <laughs> i know the difference um and yeah i love this you guys the flavor's really good not as good as a strawberry one but it's good enough especially when it's on sale because it's cheaper so you can't go wrong um but i love it because it's non-gmo verified also it's gluten-free dairy-free and vegan so i mean that pretty much goes in line with the diet i'm on now except um it's not sugar free <laughs> this has a lot of sugar this is insane i'm just gonna go over the ingredients first before i tell you you know how much sugar is in it Okay, so the ingredients are just raspberries, water, sugar, dextrose, um, lemon juice, and carob bean gum. So there's literally only one, two, three, four, five, six ingredients, which is really good for a sorbet. Like, they really did a great job of keeping everything minimal. And then, but then the bad part comes with the sugar content. So, Okay, so the total sugar for this is 64 grams. That is insane. It is, this survey is literally, it says 60% sugar, um, which is crazy. It doesn't taste as sweet as it is. is. <laughs> um, and the, the total carbs is 38 grams and everything else is very low. Um, sodium zero, cholesterol zero, trans fat, saturated fat is zero, total fat is 1%. So mainly all you're eating is just sugar and carbs. And it's a 150 calories per serving. And there is um, three servings in here. So yeah, calorie wise, it's not too bad either, but just you really have to be not on a sugar conscious diet or, you know, anything like that because it is this is all it consists of. But other than that, I would say it's great. Um, Flavor-wise and just rating-wise in general, I would probably give it more along the lines of like, maybe like an eight out of 10. Um, raspberry is fine, but I feel like, um, because I didn't see a strawberry option there at all, um, at least not dairy-free, I feel like they should have started with strawberry before they picked raspberry but strawberry is more of like a universal um berry flavor that most people go for over raspberry um raspberries are kind of seasonal fruit in general and you know it's kind of they're hard to come by in general unless they're frozen and 
it's kind of got to be your thing if you want to do the raspberry thing <laughs> but strawberries like strawberries is like everywhere i'm just i was kind of disappointed that they didn't have a strawberry option that i pretty much had to get the raspberry that was my only fruit option there that was dairy free um but it turned out good enough i would just recommend and hope that they start one if they don't have one. I do realize that the store that I was at, maybe it was just that store that didn't carry a, the strawberry flavor, but I'm thinking they most likely don't have strawberry at all as far as for their dairy-free line. So hopefully they start that soon. That would be my only real critique. I wouldn't say lessen up the sugar because this obviously is a dessert type of vibe. So you're not getting this really with the intention of not having sugar. But yeah, just in a general sense, if you're at least looking for something that's dairy free and you don't care about sugar, I definitely recommend this. Um, flavor's good. It has a very good, strong um, raspberry flavor. So it is true to the flavor that they chose or the fruit that they chose. Um, and you do pick up a little bit of the lemon juice as well. It's got a good, good blend of flavor. So, so yeah, definitely check this out if you guys haven't already. Um, I believe it's kind of on the newer side. And thank you guys so much for watching this Raspberry Sorbetto food review. And please subscribe, hit the notification bell next to the subscribe button to see every time I upload a new video. And I will see you guys soon.